Plug 1 is a returning fusion rifle from Destiny 1. It's arrived in Destiny 2 as a random nightfall reward. Well, today I'm going to have a look at the Plug 1, its stats, the god roll perks to chase for PvE and PvP, plus how to get Plug 1 in Destiny 2. Well, if you're new around here or find this useful, don't forget to hit that subscribe button down below for all the latest Destiny 2 content and turn on notifications by hitting that bell. Well, the Plug 1 is a legendary energy fusion rifle with a precision frame, meaning the weapon's recoil pattern is much more predictably vertical. Looking at the stats, we got 80 for impact, 62 for range, 54 for stability, 42 for handling, 38 for reload speed. It's got a charge time of 740 with 6 in the magazine. Well, next up, let's have a look at the Plug 1 God Rolls for PvE and PvP. So for PvE, Heating Up and Reservoir Burst to be a decent roll. So Heating Up is the trait for final blows with a weapon increased accuracy and stability while improving the vertical recoil. Reservoir Burst has the effect of when your battery is full, your next burst deals additional damage and causes your enemies to explode, which is always entertaining. Liquid Coils are really good for the battery, so slower building charge for that higher damage and that increases the impact damage but does have a slower charge time. And finally, corkscrew rifling is really good for that increase in range and stability and that slight increase in handling speed. But also feeding frenzy and cornered are good for PvE too, with cornered giving you faster charge time when surrounded by enemies. For PvP, corkscrew rifling, protection fuse or accelerated coils, heating up and kickstart is a deadly combination. So what we want to do is greatly increase the range on this one for PvP and corkscrew rifling and projection fuse give us a plus 15 to the range stats making it very useful across PvP maps. Accelerated coils is also good for reducing the charge time and heating up is great especially in 6v6 if you get a kill this fusion becomes much more effective and deadly and kickstart on the other hand is new fusion rifle perk taking this one up a notch or two so after you slide your charge rate will decrease and damage will increase for a short period of time if you don't like sliding around the ground, then backup plan is always a safe bet. Another decent role for PvP would be Killing Wind a backup plan, so Killing Wind trait is about final blows that grant increased mobility, weapon range and increased handling for a short duration. Then backup plan is good because you get greatly reduced charge time and increased handling speed, and that combo is absolutely deadly for PvP. Well next up, let's have a look at how to get Plug 1 in Destiny 2. So to get Plug 1 in Season of the Splicer, it is a Nightfall specific reward. So the rewards rotate each week and it's also a random drop at the end of Nightfalls, so it isn't guaranteed. Well, the higher the difficulty of the Nightfall, the more likely it is to drop. And I found a good balance on Legend or Master Nightfalls, with Plug 1 dropping for me on my second Nightfall run. Well, the best thing to do is get a few friends together and do a run, but if you don't have friends to play with, you can always check out the Bungie Companion app and use the Fireteam section or use a website like Destiny Tracker. We do have a This Week in Video Games Discord, so it's always worth coming in there and see if anyone is up for a game. You can find the links down below for more information. Well, regarding the Nightfall rotation of weapons, each week there is a different Nightfall weapon on offer, so you have a week to farm for this weapon. So Plug 1 is available from the 1st until the 8th of June 2021, and it's going to be back in three weeks' time from the 22nd of June. And I do a video every Tuesday talking about the weekly reset, so subscribe and hit notifications to never miss what's going on in the Destiny universe. Well, let me know down in the comments what you think of Plug 1 and let me know what roles you got and also which roles you are going for. Well, that is it for this guide for how to get the Plug 1 in Destiny 2. And as always, thank you so much for watching. For more Destiny 2 content like this, hit that subscribe button down below and subscribe to This Week in Video Games. If you want to join the community, check out the Discord link in the description, or you can follow me on Twitter at TWIVG Podcast. If you enjoyed this video, found it useful, liking and sharing the video would really help me out. Otherwise, check out the other videos on the channel. Thanks again. See you soon.
Spider is criminal, but he is no hypocrite. 